Andrew Tate said, modern society we live in has been built by men. Let's cut the crap. All the roads you see, all the buildings you see, everything around you, men built. Three, two, one. Um, I'm in the middle because physically, yeah, men built technically everything if you go back in history, but I feel like women built families and so that's sort of, I feel like everyone has their own distinct role. It comes down to like yin and yang. Um, yeah, we, we always look at things that are sort of directly in front of us and that's what people always see. Who built the Colosseum? Who built this building? Who built whatever? But there's a lot that goes on behind the scenes that makes up the whole picture. Um, I was going to say a similar point to that as well. Um, yeah, men physically built everything, but also there's a lot of things that men won't let women partake in, like including work, like the workforce, sports, things like that. Just because men physically did that doesn't mean that women didn't like women don't want to do those kind of things like you know I remember being younger wanting to play football and boys be like you can't fucking play football you're a girl like shit like that it's not that we didn't want to be part of it it's that a lot of the time we actually couldn't be and that you can see that if you look through history in every type of culture um and yeah exactly like men might have gone to war did all that but we we also yeah built families we also put food on the table for when they came home like it took it took two to tango again, because like, you know, there's men and women and others, and we all work together to create the society that we live in. If you want to define build, like physically what you said, then yeah, okay. Most men have built buildings, whatnot. But if you want to go into details about how women have built certain societies and being able to accept things like, like shed light on things like depression and all those things. Um, women have done a lot more in that respect. Again, the whole feminine and masculine energy coming together. Yeah, I um, wanted to add on that as well. Like, yes, today we've got, you know, modern society, but how much, and, you know, let's say if, if you said that, you know, men built modern society as we see it today, how much better would it have been now if women were able to participate way back then because as you said like you know we weren't really able to do much you know back in the day as we were now just because we're more socially aware so yeah you know today's cool we've got luxuries and whatnot but like imagine how much more we would have had now if women were able to participate back then to say that there's only a physical working aspect and then the at home aspect I feel is very narrow minded because if you look at big buildings, it's not just the physical work, it's the design, it's the organising people. Women can do that just because they are physiologically not as strong as men doesn't mean that they can't do other things and they shouldn't just be relegated to the household. Okay, so physically speaking, I do believe men created and built society as to what it is. Um, but in saying in most of the answers here, that women build the home. I do agree to an extent, but it takes both men and women to build a home and a family. Um, that's pretty much all I have to say right now about that. 